tearful Jimmy Kimmel breaks down on air as he tells how his 10-day-old son had life-saving open-heart surgery just hours after he was born and emotional Jimmy Kimmel has tearfully revealed his baby son had to have life-saving open-heart surgery soon after he was born 10 days ago. The late-night TV host opened his show on Monday with the news that his wife Molly McNerney, 39, had given birth to their second child, William Billy Kimmel, on April 21 in Los Angeles. But Kimmel, 49, quickly broke down as he detailed the terrifying health troubles Billy had endured and that he had successfully undergone risky heart surgery after he was born. It is a scary story, but it has a happy ending, he said as he began a teary 15-minute opening monologue. Kimmel, his wife, their two-year-old daughter Jane and Billy were in the recovery room three hours later at Cedars-Sinai Medical Center when a nurse noticed a murmur in the newborn's heart. He appeared a normal healthy baby, he said. My wife was in bed relaxing, a very attentive nurse at Cedars-Sinai heard a murmur in his heart and noticed he was a bit purple, which is not common. The doctors determined he wasn't getting enough oxygen in his blood, either in his heart or lungs. They did an x-ray and his lungs were fine, which meant his heart wasn't. It's a terrifying thing. They found that Billy was born with a heart disease. Kimmel said the congenital heart disease meant his son had a hole in the wall of the left and right side of his heart. Billy was rushed to Children's Hospital Los Angeles for emergency heart surgery. Kimmel said the surgery was a success, but Billy will have to have another surgery in three to six months and a third non-invasive surgery when he's older. He broke down as he shared a photo of Billy in intensive care with tubes coming out of his little body. Kimmel then showed a picture of the newborn following his successful surgery. Kimmel revealed they were allowed to take their son home six days after the surgery. He emotionally thanked a number of people, including the doctors and nurses who helped Billy. Every one of my friends was there 100%. We had atheists praying for us, okay? We had people who do not believe in God praying to him. And I hate to even say, but even that son of ABH Matt Damon sent flowers, he said. Most of all, I want to thank my wife Molly. First of all, for allowing me to have sex with her in the first place, he joked. But also for being so strong and level-headed and positive and loving during the worst nightmare a new mother could experience. I couldn't ask for a better partner, and I'm so happy we had this baby together. I'm definitely getting a vasectomy after this. He also urged his audience to donate to Children's Hospital Los Angeles and pleaded with politicians to make sure all Americans, regardless of wealth, have access to health care. If your baby is going to die it should matter how much money you make, he said. I hope you never have to go there, but if you do you'll see so many kids from it, so many financial backgrounds being cared for so well with so much compassion. Kimmel said he will be on paternity leave for the rest of the week and a number of famous faces will be stepping in to cover for him. Billy is Kimmel's fourth child. He has two older children from his first marriage to Gina Matty, 25-year-old Catherine and 23-year-old Kevin. He also has a two-year-old daughter, Jane, with his current wife, 